Hello students. Today we will study English subject of class third. We have started our first chapter paper kite in previous lecture. Now let's do the exercise related to this chapter. Let's start with the first question. Answer these questions. Number the pictures in the correct order that they happened in the poem. I have explained you the poem. So accordingly, we will just set the numbers. Number one. Firstly, the boy bought a kite. That is, this will be the number one. He started flying it. That will be number two. This will be number one. This will be number two. And his fly and his kite stuck in the tree. So this will be the third part. Okay. This will these all are the answers for it. First, second, and third. Number two, people fly kites on August fifteenth. Yes, on fifteenth of August, people fly kite to show the independence from British rule. They are very happy, so they fly kite on August fifteenth. You have to write the answer here. What is common between the kite and the boy in the poem? Of course, the common thing between the kite and the boy is that the kite also stick on the branches of the tree, and boy was assuming himself to be stuck on the branches of the tree. This is common in both of them. Okay. Now. Let's enjoy the poem. Answer these questions. Read the poem again. Write all the pairs of rhyming words that you see. Poem में जितने भी rhyming words मिले थे, you have to write it. Let's see how many rhyming words are there in the poem. Yesterday, way. Yes, yesterday. Way, luck, stuck means it sounds quite similar. एक जैसा लगता है सुनने पर. Luck, stuck. Stick, arithmetic. Stick, arithmetic. These are the three pairs of rhyming words which you have to write in your answers. In the poem, we came across the words. Kite and fly, both these words have more than one meaning. अब जो हमने poem में देखा कि kite और fly दो words आए हैं, इनकी double double meaning हो रही है. Let's see क्या क्या हो रहा है. Kite is a thing made of paper which you can fly. Kite एक चीज है जिसको हम उड़ाते हैं, वो paper की बनी होती है. दूसरी Kite is also the name of a bird. Of course, kite एक bird का भी नाम है. ये आप जानते ही हैं. Fly. Fly as a verb. अगर हम verb के रूप में लें इसको, तो means to move through the air. Means हमको जो हवा में हम उड़ते हैं या चलते हैं, जो movement होती है हवा में, उसे हम fly कहते हैं. हवा में उड़ना. Fly. Fly as a noun. अगर हम noun के रूप में इसको ले रहे हैं, यहाँ तो verb है, यहाँ काम हो रहा है, means उड़ रहा है हवा में। यहाँ पे fly as a noun लिया है, तो it is the name of an insect. Fly एक insect को भी कहते हैं। Such words which have the same spelling or pronunciation but different meanings are called homonyms. उसे हम homonyms कहते हैं, means सुनने में भी एक जैसा है, spelling में भी एक जैसा है, but double meanings हैं। meanings जब double होती हैं, but spelling और pronunciation same होता है, उसको हम homonyms कहते हैं। Okay? Write three pairs of such words that you can think of and give their meanings. हम यहाँ पे अब वो सारे words लिखेंगे जो similar spellings हों, but उसकी meaning different हो। and this will be your homework students thanks thanks all and that's all for today